Hello, everyone. Today in this session, we will be introducing you to the SSH Vulnerability Helper Lab App. This Lab App will help you to fix slash mitigate some of the known vulnerabilities reported for Red Hat Enterprise Linux. Few examples of the vulnerabilities which are covered as part of this Lab App are SSH server supports weak key exchange algorithm, SSH CBC mode ciphers enabled, SSH insecure HMAC algorithms enabled, Terrapin attack. The next few steps will explain the process of accessing this lab app and enable you to get the understanding of how it works. In order to access the lab app, visit https colon forward slash forward slash access dot com slash labs. On the lab app page, please search for SSH vulnerability helper or SSH VH. This will take you to the lab page where you will see options related to generate Ansible playbook product versions, and SSH vulnerabilities reported. The generate Ansible playbook option will help you fix slash mitigate the below reported vulnerabilities on multiple servers at one go. In order for you to apply these fixes slash mitigations on multiple servers, you have to click on the start here button and enter the IP address of the servers where these vulnerabilities need to be remediated. Click on the generate script, which will be downloaded on the system. Downloaded zip needs to be extracted on Ansible control node from where you are able to manage mentioned IPs. You can extract the zip on Ansible control node and execute the below command. There is another section to fix slash mitigate individual vulnerability. In order to do that, you can select the product version along with the SSH vulnerability from the drop-down list to get the troubleshooting steps slash fixes for the issue. Demonstrating an example. Select 9 from Red Hat Enterprise Linux version. Select SSH server supports wiki exchange algorithm. Follow the highlighted steps to fix slash mitigate. For details, visit the verified link of Red Hat solution slash articles given at the bottom. Likewise, follow the same steps for the other Red Hat Enterprise Linux versions. In order for you to validate all the changes done, we have added the validate your changes section with all the commands. Hope this information is helpful. Please do see our other videos, which explains the usage process for other customer lab applications like Postfix, Upgrade Helper, etc.